So Raw did uh, 2.11 million viewers, and it was a .64 and 18 to 49. So once again, you know, on on cable and network, on all of television, Raw was the most watched show, not in its time slot, of the day. There was nothing else on Monday on television at any time that did a better 18 to 49 number than Monday Night Raw. Besides the news. No, nothing. Nothing? It was the number one show of the whole day in 18 to 49. So uh, Raw was first in women 18 to 49, more than doubled everything on cable in men 18 to 49, more than doubled everything on cable in 18 to 34, beat everything but The Bachelor on television in uh, 18 to 34. And uh, in total viewers, it trailed news, but in 18 to 49, it trailed nothing. So, uh, yeah, you know, as noted, obviously, you know, there's no football. There's no football competition, and it was the day after the Royal Rumble. But last year, there was also no football, and there was a show the day after the Royal Rumble. And Raw this year was up 13% in viewers, up 34% from the post-Royal Rumble show in 18 to 49. And in 18 to 34... Compared to last year's show, the exact same show, the day after the Royal Rumble last year with no football, up 45% in 18 to 34. So WWE is hot. For those of you that uh, haven't noticed, 2.22 million first hour, 2.17 million second hour, which was a, a really, really good. Uh, they, they basically maintained everybody. From hour one to hour two. And then it did fall to 1.96 million in hour three. So there you go. You know? And I, I, I don't know, you know, what it is. Because, you know, it's like, I watch the show and it is different. But even I will tell you, it's not substantially different with the exception of... Actually, you know what? It is in some way substantially different because... We can now count on, like, two hands the number of of storylines that they've advertised and changed. Literally, it's two. It's two. And uh, last week, they would do two to three changes every week. It was like there was no point when Raw was over telling you what was announced for next week because it just wasn't going to happen. Now, when they announce stuff for next week, it happens, uh, I guess it would be three times now because there was also that cage match. But uh, it happens virtually every single time. So I don't know if it's just... They announce what's going to happen and then do it. I don't know if there's a a portion of the fan base that, you know, people would always say, especially after the Saudi shows, like, I ain't watching this. I, I hate Vince. I cannot support Vince McMahon. And it's always like, eh, you know, they say that, but I don't know if I buy it. Well, you know, a lot of this year-over-year change is is all after Vince left. And so it's possible there there is a percentage of fans that are like, you know, he's he's not booking this thing and he's... I guess he's kind of back now trying to sell it. But, you know, whatever it is, it's uh, it's way up from where it was a year ago. And good for them. I don't think it's a cop-out to say that it's a little mix of everything. It is a little mix it? of everything, yes. I mean, if you look at, at the economy, if you're going out less, and we saw this crunch as we went into the holidays with, you know, the with that situation— well, there's one thing you don't have to to worry about paying for if, if you've already got Peacock or you already got cable. There's, you know, the USA Network and football is out of the way and they have been getting hot and there has been a lot of media attention put on them for maybe somebody who has not been paying attention closely, who heard about all of this chaos going on and is wondering you know, hey, I haven't seen it for a while. Has it changed, you know, since the last time I saw it? I think it's just a really a mix of everything. And the fact that they're hot at a time where there's not much competition right now. Obviously, the entertainment field is not giving them much to work with. Very disappointed with Below Deck here, you know. I thought I was going to give some sort of competition going on, but no, apparently not. And you're at a time where college basketball is not cooking yet. The NBA is not cooking other than the All-Star break. NHL, the only thing going on people looking forward to for the most part right now is the trade deadline in a couple of weeks. So it's like... 
this is a great time for them to shine a light upon themselves and have a really good run and put their best foot forward, not only leading into WrestleMania and Elimination Chamber for that matter, but because obviously it seems like the rest of the entertainment industry has ceded itself to them. Yeah, and as noted here, like SmackDown Friday, that, that show's going to do huge because it yeah. is the follow-up to the big angle at the Royal Rumble. What's Jay doing? What's Sammy doing? What's Roman doing? Yeah, none they of them pretty on much, Raw. Yeah, we're, we're getting Roman and Sammy in Montreal, so it's got to be announced. they got to shoot that angle to get it going. Yeah. So that's going to be a big show coming up on Friday. Here is some actual commentary from Bash and Burger. I love barbecue. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> During this match, uh, I believe uh, Bastion was uh, choking on his chicken wings. Bastion said, uh, Vince, you haven't lived up to your contract. I uh, require four or five pizzas delivered in a wheelbarrow. It was at this point that Bastion Booger demanded hot dogs. <laughs> Were they delivered it? in a wheelbarrow, too? Yeah. That's a big hot dog. We are told Razor and Zanetti have called. It's a big wiener. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, Brian. Big juicy wiener. Yes, in between two buns. <laughs> oh, you broke Vinny. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.